When launching a subscription business, you first must pick a subscription growth model. Each growth model has its own four scaling drivers that grows. And by choosing the model, you can pick the correct drivers so that you can scale quickly. We're going to show you how to identify the best model for your subscription business and more in this episode of Be Unleavable Subscription Growth. Welcome to Be Unleavable Subscription Growth. I'm your host, Robert Scrobe. One of the great challenges once you identify the uh, nine proven subscription growth models is to figure out which one is right for you. Uh, we want to make sure that you go ahead and download these handouts I'm going to be uh, referring to during this video at 9subscriptiongrowthmodels.com. That URL is going to redirect straight to the, the file. It's going to download right into your browser, no opt-in or anything. I just want to make sure that I, I get this into your hands because it could be so pivotal in helping you you choose the best model, identify the four growth drivers that are going to help grow that model, and help you experience fast recurring revenue growth. And what we're going to do today is really go through an example of subscription growth together uh, using the Raw Honey Shop. The, the Raw Honey Shop it was a, it is a registrant for a seminar that I launched a few weeks ago and uh, sent in homework. And I really thought that it was such a great example that I really wanted to share with you today. Uh, the Raw Honey Shop is a online store selling raw honey. And of course, raw honey is uh, is you know, a little different that it hasn't been pasteurized. And so it has all the original uh, vitamins and minerals and everything good about honey is still there and uh, hasn't been uh, taken away. And I absolutely encourage you to, uh, to, to grab some honey at a raw honey shop. But what we're going to talk about today is kind of one of the real questions that I worked with uh, with the Raw Honey Shop is what subscription model uh, should you think about when you are, you know, a normal uh, e-commerce shop, you know, in this case, selling honey, uh, you know, for 16.99 euro or pounds, excuse me, um, online, uh, 21.99 pounds and uh, 20, you know, for, you know, raw organic wild lavender honey. Yeah. How do you launch a subscription business? Well, there's actually quite a few different options. Uh, one uh, option is the access model. And of course, when you download these nine subscription models, you're gonna to wanna to print these models out. And not only that, print them out two-sided because on the first side, you have the, the four subscription growth drivers of the model, in this case, the access model. And on the back, there are several examples. And when you print them out, you can kind of pass them around and have them on the, on the table. They're kind of like, almost like baseball cards. You can kind of revere, refer to them. And when, when you're in the PDF, you gotta actually click on the logos. And if you clicked on that logo right there, that's gonna take you to the Produce Club. And this gives you an opportunity. So the first model we're gonna discuss is the access model. So here is an example of the produce uh, uh, produce box where you pay $20 and you become a member that allows you to place orders for produce that's available each week. And this produce is fresh and farm raised from your own community. And uh, so, but $20 is the uh, price in order to access the subscription program. And that's you know, called the access model with the key example of Costco, which you, know, you have to pay in order to be able to access the store. Well, one great way of the Raw Honey Club to launch a subscription or membership would be to pay charge for access to be able to buy the raw honey. Entirely appropriate uh, model and something that could very well work. Another example of uh, of a uh, of a subscription business would be the pre-approved model. In this case, the pre-approved kind of key example is Dollar Shave Club, and you've got the four. Uh, subscription growth drivers of the pre-approved model on this side of the handout. And on this side of the handout, you have Black Rifle Coffee. And uh, this is a great example of, 
you know, is simply a subscription business that when you when you purchase the uh, Black Rifle Coffee, it gives you an opportunity to subscribe. And it's actually even part of the checkout process that you, you choose the type of coffee you want, you choose the style you want, whether it's you know, and, and, and beans or roasted, or they, you know, give it to you and, and, uh, you know, as it's all chopped up and ready to, ready to percolate, or they give it to you in K cups, however you want it, they'll sell it to you. And then as you check out, they'll offer the opportunity to subscribe. And so that you can have your black rifle coffee delivered to you on an ongoing basis. Well, why not do that with the, with, uh, with the honey? And so that once you try the Giorgio's Raw Mountain Forest Honey, a great taste award winner, and you're checking out for 28.99 pounds, why not give uh, them an opportunity to subscribe and receive that honey on a regular basis, either monthly or bi-monthly, and even have a collection of honeys that are that are delivered on an ongoing basis. So that could be the the second type of subscription model, and. That, of course, is the, the pre-approved model. Then uh, third is curation. And that's, you know, I, I'd like to example, exemplify by the, um, the, the, the Olive Oil Club. And what the Olive Oil Club does, and I would absolutely encourage you to check out freshpressedoliveoil.com. And here they've actually got a $39 bottle where you can get started with a subscription. But what it is, is on a quarterly basis, uh, TJ Robinson selects uh, terrific fresh pressed olive oil from around the world. And it's different, um, you, know, did, you know, different seasons have different hemispheres because you know, the uh, northern hemisphere is good during certain times of year in order to get the olive oil fresh, fresh, and, fresh and to you quickly. And then sometimes southern hemisphere places like Australia, Brazil, um, have the best olive oil that time of year. So sometimes it's from Europe, Spain, uh, Italy, uh, other uh, Greece, of course, and, uh, and other times it's in other parts. And so you get every three months, you get three bottles of olive oil delivered to you. And so uh, TJ is doing the hard work of curating the olive oil, identifying the best vineyards and the best, I guess it's not a vineyard, it's a grove uh, maybe for olive oil, and uh, the best uh, farms that produce olive oil, get it fresh pressed and to have the, the best uh, the flavor. And, uh, and I've, uh, I've had the honor, uh, TJ has been a, a client of mine for years ago, many years ago, and I've had the honor of having the Olive Oil Club for, I, I can't even tell you how many years since, and it's been spectacular. We've, TJ curates the olive oil and, you know, which of the, the, all of the olive oils that are farm in, are farmed in Italy, which are the three that uh, are the ones that you should try uh, for this three months, and it's a spectacular club, and could be another great model for the raw honey shop uh, to curate two or three um, jars of honey every every three months, or or, you know, or every, maybe even every month, and have a subscription program for honey. And then finally is the VIP program, and that is exemplified by the GNC Pro Access, which is. $39.99 a year. And, you know, it's similar to an Amazon Prime where you get special benefits as a GNC Pro member. And that could be easy enough for the, the raw honey shop. They could have different types of uh, benefits, exclusive access, uh, early access to uh, honeys that become available, maybe even a discount or similar to Amazon Prime, perhaps even free shipping uh, for their special members of their VIP club. But there would be a, you know, a, a, a payment every year, uh, and then that would enable subscribers to be part of that club. One of the key things is now like which subscription, right? Which program is best for you? And what I found is that the answer lies in your target audience, that your customers that, that, that are, are who you're trying to serve. And when you understand your customers, what they're looking for, the types of challenges they have, the problems that they're looking to solve, the, the feelings that they're trying to get when they purchase their products from you, then that really 
uh, it gives you the answer as to which of the nine subscription models you want to choose. And then uh, once you listen to your customers and choose the model, the four subscription drivers are really you know, how you create the offer, you know, how you create the retention, where all the lifetime value comes from, and how you scale this quickly in order to grow your subscription revenue. So uh, take a quick look at the 9subscriptionmodels.com. You'll want to download that, and it's a, a great way of studying the different models. You'll want to print them out and have each model uh, out so you can kind of look at the examples, uh, look at the, 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 the four growth drivers, and uh, really make sure that, uh, that you're able to grow a subscription business. I'm, I've, I've produced these because I was really tired of seeing folks struggle because they were kind of trying to get some growth drivers from here that are for a different model and the stuff doesn't work. Uh, it just doesn't grow like it should. So uh, really, I'm publishing these in order to help you grow your subscription revenue so that you can experience exponential growth again. So check out those models. Uh, if this uh, program has been helpful to you, if it gave you some insight into the subscription world, please uh, click the like button, uh, click to subscribe, and also that bell so that you'll be notified for future episodes. And give me some comments. Let me know if this is helpful. Maybe if you have another idea, heck, maybe the uh, Honey Shop should have a, a SaaS op option or even an app. Um, and use one of, or even publishing. Maybe they could be publishing uh, products on Raw Honey and uh, helping them uh, you know, use one of the other subscription models. Let me know in the comments, so, uh, and I'd love to hear from you. And uh, look forward to seeing you on the next episode of Be Unleavable Subscription Growth.